New at 5 o'clock, the family of Bobby Harvey, the man behind a controversial arrest by Burlington police, have just wrapped up a news conference to explain their side of the story. Well, this is the source of the controversy. It is Harvey's arrest. His family says Burlington police use excessive force when arresting him. Police say the video, though, does not tell the whole story. They first responded after receiving a call about an alleged assault on Friday night. When officers arrived and started to talk to Harvey, investigators say he became uncooperative and assaulted the officers. They say he grabbed an officer's stun gun and also bit another officer. But Harvey's family says it was the officers who went too far. I found out from a third party at 1030. That was the time that the time had changed. Because I do not live in this area. I was not able to be there in time to support my brother. And that was a slap in the face. Today, Burlington police sent us these photos showing the injuries the three officers received while trying to take Harvey into custody. Harvey was also hurt in the incident, but all three were treated with non-life-threatening injuries. Burlington police held their own news conference yesterday. Chief Smythe defended his officers using force during the arrest. We had every reason to contact Mr. Harvey. That reason was lawful, and the conduct that happened after that is driven by his resistive and assaultive behavior, and we responded to that. I'm not sure what the public thinks that looks like when we have a nice arrest of a person who is violently resisting the police. There is no way to take a person into custody nicely in what amounts to a knockdown, drag out fight on the side of the road. That's going to look bad. Chief Smythe is asking for body cam footage to be released to give clarity of that arrest. Meantime, WFMY News News Alma McCarty is live now at that press conference with more on what the family members are saying. Yes, this press conference just wrapped up only a few minutes ago and family, friends and supporters of Barbie, Bobby Harvey are asking for the same thing as the police chief to release that body cam footage. But as you said before, they believe that this arrest was excessive force and that the charges against Bobby should be dropped. They, it was a pretty emotional press conference. In fact, the sister of Bobby Harvey, Sandra Harvey, said that her brother was treated like an animal by those officers in the video and that the video she took doesn't lie. And it shows some racial injustice here in Burlington. And she also said that they are demanding justice for Bobby, again, that these charges be dropped, and that he was just an innocent bystander going about his business. Um, police have also said that he, in fact, was not the suspect that they were looking for, but all of this stemmed from when he resisted arrest and assaulted police officers. Again, these people are asking for the body camera footage to be released to show the whole picture here, the same thing that the police officers are also looking for as well. Again, um, we can find more about this online, uh, WFMYNews2.com. For now, live in Burlington, Alma McCarty, WFMY News 2.